Welcome to the Monday Night War Season 3. I am Luco in DAD, representing Monday Night Raw. I'm Chopper Pete Quinnell, representing Monday Night Smackdown, and this is episode number one of Season 3 of the Monday Night War. We are playing my GM mode on WWE 2K23. And this episode is sponsored by WWE 2K23. Click the link in the video description down below to get your copy of the game with the showcase mode based around John Cena's career. New modes of gameplay like war games and the new and improved my gm mode which is where we find ourselves today pete we have our rosters we do if you haven't watched it already uh go and watch the draft day episode to see who we have on each roster got my full roster here i don't know what i'm doing with any of them yeah well but they do exist yeah so i think i'm gonna be going first i assume so yeah because i was slated myself as player one mm -hmm. um so alternating season one you went first season two i went first now yeah. season three you go first that makes sense gives you time to, to fix figure up out your what notes. I'm doing. <laughs> Because your notes are a mess. Yeah. The grid system, Pete. It works, works. It works for New York and Vancouver, and it works for my GM <laughs> mode. Right, so we're going to play through uh, episode one here. Mm. Um, now, there is a new thing within my GM mode, the mm -hmm. Hall of Fame. That's what it says up on the screen here right now. Yeah. To enter the Hall of Fame, prove you're the best, be the first to GM to earn 10 Hall of Fame trophies. Mm -hmm. So these are awarded throughout the season. Yeah. Doing certain things gets you, like, extra power cards and yep. stuff. But I, there's not enough time for us to like try. Like I think a lot of this we're going to be doing by accident. <laughs> yes, I agree. We may earn extra stuff by accident. Yes. Because there'll be things, and some of them are like have eight weeks of mm -hmm. call out promos or eight yeah, weeks yeah, of yeah. self promos or like do nine weeks of this match type. I just think a lot of that I'm going to do. I'll be like, oh, right, cool. I've done that now. Oh, cool. I'm on eight. Sweet. Yeah. Because I think, I like, you know, the commissioner goals? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'll be doing those. Mm -hmm. Hall of Fame stuff? I may just... Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. But we'll see. Who knows? Maybe it'll become like... Maybe it's. I'm going to find out it's like logistics is actually the most important thing in the game. Yeah, this is going to be like one of us will have one more Hall of Fame trophy than the other. <laughs> yeah. And suddenly it's going to mean... And win. <laughs> like, yeah, I'm, now I win because of that. I'll have less fans, less money, but I'll have one more trophy, which means I win. Well, so we'll find out. We will. As, we'll find out as the game goes. So that's the yeah. thing as well. We don't fully know as well the winning parameters yet. We'll figure it out. We're going to figure a lot out. We're going to learn it all together. This is your first time here on Monday Night War. We have seven minutes each to book our shows. Yes. And that's it. Yeah. Seven minutes each. That's, seven that's, minutes. that's it. That's the rule. The other person listens to some music while the other person's booking, so they can't hear what they're doing. That's true. And then we'll go through both of our shows afterwards and see who is number one at the end of the week. Indeed. Right. So sort your music out, Pete. I'm, I'm going my, to. I've got my seven minutes to go. Luke. Yep. Last season, you know, yeah, yeah. we were we were we were talking about music all the time. We ended up making a playlist. We did uh, of of all the music that we that we listened to compiled. We are definitely going to have to update that playlist because in the time between season two and season three, I've played a little game called Persona Five, and I've fallen in love with the soundtrack of it. So every week, I'm going to be saying a different Persona Five track that I'm going to be listening to because there's so many. So it, are you basically? exclusively Persona 5 this, so this entire, whole season. The whole yes. season. The whole season. It will Pete, just be Persona 5 Pete, tracks. Vary up the playlist, man. There's enough variety on this soundtrack, Luke. Hey, I added in so much cool stuff. This is cool! I'm not saying it's not cool, Pete. You it's implied actually, no, 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 it's not no, cool. No, I didn't, Pete. I'm actually going to say it's well cool. But it's also cooler to have that and other stuff. <laughs> There's a bunch of stuff from other seasons that's already cool. This is just adding in the cool factor. Yeah, okay. Say so, I'm going to listen to a little track called Willpower. <laughs> I'm so excited. That's actually what he's excited for is just to God, listen to this. Loud. What? Is it that? You're not excited to play the game. You're still excited. No, no, right. I'm more excited for the music right now. Pete, before we start, look. Oh. <sighs> Do you know what? It's last two seasons were a bit rough on me. Itrid. It itrid. Um, but you know, just, I need not only just to talk to myself, I need some words of encouragement. Just bear, just bear with me. Just bear with me. Hey Luke. So I hear you're doing your third season of Monday Night War, and this time it's in WWE 2K23. Now, there's a lot more features to go through this year, so that means many more things for you to forget. But this is a new game. This is a new you. And this time, Luke, I believe in you. Pete may have won the first two seasons, but this time is your time. 
Pete is an arrogant, selfish general manager, but you, Luke, you've got a heart of gold. You've got the touch. You have the power. You will win this, Luke. You will win. So make sure all of you watching subscribe to Parts Fun Known to watch a new episode every Monday. Let the Monday Night War begin. Oh, and Luke, one more thing. Don't forget to tell Pete every track you're listening to when he does his booking. It really distracts him. Yeah, that's right, Pete. I've got Xavier Woods on my side. That is, one, so cool. And two, what? Yeah. That's, Woods, he likes me. What are I gonna say? Like, look, He booked SmackDown! He should like me! Look, I, ju I just sent him a message and I was like, yo, Z. But I call him Z, you know. He calls me... He, Z? Yeah, he calls me Captain Cool. <laughs> and uh, I just said, like, look, Z. Uh, Why Z? Because it sounds like Xavier. But that's a letter Z! Yeah, I know, that's where it's funny. And I said, look, Z, if you could help me out here, you know, I need some words of encouragement. And he said, don't worry, Captain Cool, uh, I got you. Uh, here's a video, Get it, you know, just play this before, you know, when you need it. You have a star on that says, I tried. <laughs> I have a star that says it trids. It trids. And I've got Xavier Woods on my side. Thanks, Woods. Thank you very much, Xavier Woods. Right, okay. I'm gonna put it on loop. Luke, it's week one. Good things happen to good people. Kind people are your kind of people. I'm ready. Uh, I'm gonna play my music. Have fun. I'm so worried. I'm so worried. Have fun. Okay, I'm I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. Okay, right. Continue. Series one. Okay. <sighs> Three, two, one. Let's -a go. All right, Triple H. Owen, good to talk to you. With the roster we have, I think we'll do okay. Exit. Continued booking. Lovely stuff. Okay. Select my champion. Um. Okay. What am I gonna do? Do I wanna do Gunther or Gunther or KO? Because I've got Gunther feuding with Mello. Do I put it on Owens? Or do I put it on... <laughs> Logan Paul. <laughs> I'm the worst. You come to Monday Night Raw for the Megastar, so of course I'm going to put the WWE Championship on the biggest Megastar possible. And I couldn't get access to YouTube Megastar Laurie Blake, so I'm putting it on Logan Paul instead. Nasca or Rhea? Rhea. Select. Those are my champs. Right, okay. So ensure that your least popular available bruiser is in a match this week. Who the f*** is that? Right, okay. First of all, show logistics. I've got nothing I can change anyway. It's this, it's this, it's this, it's this, it's this, it's this. Very good to check that first. Right, so main event is going to be uh, Logan Paul versus... Kevin Owens, Bruiser, title is on the line. Love that big title match design as well. Cool. Oh, actually, normal match, one-on-one. Uh, -on -one. So that is, it costs 90,000, but 10,000 fans, three superstar popularity increase. Um, so submission match resolves a rivalry and has an additional thousand pounds per rivalry. Cool. Uh, Iron Man match, morale to win and morale to lose it. Interesting. Um, a steel cage is win by submission and that adds a 50%. So that's interesting because if this goes to level one, that might actually instantly increase it to level two. But I think I'm gonna go all out because I've got money here. So backstage brawl, title match, lovely save. Opening match, normal one-on-one -on -one match is going to be Rhea Ripley versus Asuka. Title is on the line. Uh, and it's going to be, do I do this one as the uh, steel cage? Steel cage. Done. Right, show budget, this and the other. Cool. Um, also going to do a tag team. Uh, yes, I'm going to do a tag team. Uh, do, do, oh, okay, that's fine. Do a tornado tag plus ten percent chance injury. Uh, let's do a tables match, and that is going to be the team of Cody Rhodes and Tyler Tyler Bate Tyler Bate Tyler Tyler Bate versus Cedric and Sammy. Title is on the line. 
lovely stuff. And then this one is Gunther versus Carmelo Hayes. Title is on the line, and we'll do that as one-on-one. -on -one. Uh, do I just do this as, maybe I just do this as a normal match. Let's not go mad, eh? Or do I go mad? Do I go insane? No, I don't think I will. I don't think I'll go mad. Do I go mad? I'm gonna go mad. The title is on the line. Done. Okay, so that's cool. Um, I'm gonna have a call out promo of uh, Dewdrop calling out. Is she feuding with Dewdrop is EO Sky. Yeah, that's right. That's fine. Cool. Now, do I actually change up what I'm doing here? Right. What have I got? Three minutes left. Sign free agents. Because I've got a couple of things I need to do here. So I've got to get someone who can tag with Gigi and Indy. So, like, <laughs> like Carolina Reaper, <laughs> Flint Mixter, medical. <laughs> Oh, I love medical Bill Flint McStones. He's also very cool. All right, sorry, don't get distracted by the funny names. Um, because what I need is a. I should note this down. Like, if I get like a, a heel fighter or a heel bruiser. Um, okay, let's not do this now because I can't think of what I'm going to do. Uh, right, so instead, self promo. Um, I can do. GG and you I can do a charity promo Indy Hartwell. Uh cool. Okay. Right, let's have a look at power cards. Real steel. One randomly booked steel cage match in your service of a higher rating than normal. That's 50 grand. Put the budget for it. Oh, view star. And that's I might buy that one as well. First legend you sign this week will be free. So that's cool. Um, yeah, do I buy the real steel as well? Do I save? Okay, I've done that one. That's fine. I actually don't know who my least popular bruiser is. I think I've only got, I've only got a handful of bruisers anyway. Um, cool, cool, cool. Um, well, I've got time here. I've got a minute. So real steel. Do I buy that now? Let's use my... Should, do you know what, maybe I can do, I've got a minute here, so, uh, manage roster, so Gigi is a specialist and Indy is a specialist as well, so what I could do is get a giant on a cruiser and a fight on a bruiser, this is for my women's tag feud essentially, um, so, because I was thinking of combining Dewdrop and EO into that feud, which I still could do, and I'll just do that next week if I change this and do that. Actually, it's just a charity promo. Yeah, maybe I'll do that, and then I can convert those into the women's tag feud, which I can sort out next week. Right, in which case, I think I'm good to go. Right, three, two, one. Now, I think I've played this pretty smart and tactfully because Pete spent a lot of money buying some extra nobodies to go on his stupid SmackDown stupid roster, whereas I've saved up some of my money to spunk it all on big matches to get that early lead, the all-important early lead. I'm winning this episode. I don't need checking on me, Pete. I'm done. Donezo, mate. So how was week one? Week one, I think, was pretty good, Pete. Pretty good? I'm feeling pretty confident about okay, that. Okay. Feeling right. pretty good. And I've, I've, Happy for you. I've got some plans made for next week as well. Great. So we'll Wonderful. see how those work out for me. Yeah. Now, Pete, of course, the most interesting thing that people are going to actually want to know <sighs> is what am I adding to the playlist. Uh, I forgot about this bit. Because, Pete, you see, uh, you were talking about how you've got really into Persona 5. Yes. Uh, I have massively gone into uh, Scene Queen. Oh, 
piss and balls. Yeah. So I might listen to Bimbo Core, mm-hmm. uh, mm-hmm. Volume One, mm-hmm. um, or do I listen to Bimbo Core Volume Two, Pete? It's it's a tough call. Um, number two is your favourite number. It's where you've come every season, <laughs> so you might as well go with that. <laughs> <You> f- <laughs> Um, yeah, I might listen to... I'm going to listen to Bimbo Core Volume 1. Um, I'll start with Pink Panther, and then maybe I'll do a couple of the other tracks as well. Mm-hmm. Oh, she's awesome, Pete. Mm-hmm. There's part of me that wishes she was a wrestling fan just so I could get her involved in some wrestle talk stuff, mm-hmm. but I don't think she is. Um, but anyway, go listen to Scene Queen, everyone. She's going to be in the playlist. She's rad. Guys, let me tell you about Scene Queen. Scene Queen is the f- best thing in the world. She's called Bimbo Core. Many unbearable hours later. She is taking hardcore metal music and applying it to like early days Kesha. It's f- rad. The next day. Bimbo Core Volume 1 is great, but Bimbo Core Volume 2. Let me f- tell you, that's an album right there. Anyway, cool. I need my time. Book, book your stupid show. What are you delaying for? I can't recognize my face because I've got sunglasses on. Seven minutes. Seven minutes. To on clarify, the clock. we've had an issue before in season two. Yeah, you did cheat in season two. <laughs> that's still, still not yeah, happened. I mean, that's what we're all saying, Pete. It's, <laughs> you, it's your words, not mine. We all, you all know you cheated in season two. Seven minutes on the clock. Yeah. Three, two, one. Let's go. Okay. Time for a new season. I was planning to do uh, start doing better than Raw this year. Not a problem. I plan to destroy them. Good. Great. Uh, okay, I need to pick champs. Okay, so who is the most popular? Who's got high stamina as well? Nakamura's looking pretty good. I think Nakamura's going to be entering a feud with Solo Sokoa. Does that work? Uh, yeah, I think so. Why don't we have Nakamura be the champ here? Uh, he's going to enter a feud with Solo Sokoa. And uh, over with the women, who's Bianca going to be feuding with? Carmella. That's a pretty good feud right there. Bianca Carmella. His singing will never not annoy me. Uh, okay, so that is good. Let's confirm those selections. Okay, those are my champs. Uh, jo- uh, uh, book your least popular available stuff for a match this week. I don't want to. Uh, okay. D- uh, yep. D- jo- okay. Uh, that's it. And I get... Oh my god, I get a special promotion already. Oh, I'm doing it though, aren't I? I don't want to book a Leah, but also... Uh, let me just double check that that is actually my least popular. That is my least popular, it's Aaliyah. Okay, uh, Aaliyah can enter a feud with Dana Brooke. So let's make sure that that happens. Let's, let's, it's obviously gonna be a mid-card match, isn't it? Uh, and we're gonna have Aaliyah versus Dana Brooke. Uh, I can't do a title match, I guess. I I want one, but that's fine, I guess. Uh, okay, so what, what, is, what does stuff do? One-on-one. On one. Table smash, stamina cost low, stamina cost medium, plus 50% additional rivalry level chance. That's cool. Uh, that's just a good match. That's just a good match. Uh, plus 10,000 fans, plus three star popularity increase. That's good. That's just a good match. Uh, the, the, uh, plus 1,000 fans and resolves any rivalries. Granting an additional plus 1,000 fans per rivalry level resolved. That's really cool. I'm at plus two popularity, plus 20% injury chance. Uh, plus morale to winner, minus morale to loser. Interesting. That's cool. Uh, okay, cool, 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 we're going to have Carmella. We're going to have it be a title match, because why not? Uh, and do we want something crazy? Do we want a tables match? Why don't we want a tables match? Why not, right? It's only five grand. Tables match. Let's go crazy. They've got stamina. They've eh, got stamina-ish. Um, that's fine. Uh, time match on. Yeah, why not? Go crazy. Uh, and this one, we're going to want a men's champ, Shinny Nax, uh, who's going to be feuding with Solo. Sokoa. Make it a title match. Why not? Uh, and this, we're gonna want some stuff. Um, the 90 grand. God, it's so much money. Uh, let's just do a normal one. That's fine. Uh, and... First of all, why don't we book a tag team match with... Uh, 
Mr. Big Dick Balor and um, ba -da -ba 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 -ba. why don't we do Angel, yep, versus uh, Commander Aziz and who's Balor feuding with? Balor and LA Knight, I think is the other one that we want here. Yeah, that works, right? Tag title match. Balor and Angel. That works. Aziz and LA Knight. Cool. Uh, let's do a call out here. What other feuds can we get going? We want uh, Baszler and Nikki A.S.H. Uh, whose promo ability better? Shane is is. Let's call her out. Let's do a uh, self promo. Who wants to be popular here? Who's Shelton going to get in a feud with? Uh, where are you? Benjamin and Marseille. Why don't we do a call out promo for that as well? Who's got better pro uh, mic skills? Definitely Shelton. And charity promo <laughs> from Elia Dragonoff. <laughs> Why not? Yeah, that seems like a great use of Elia Dragonoff. Okay, so that unlocks in week two. I can't do any logistics here. Uh, have I got any power? Oh, I do want this. There can be only one. One randomly booked last man standing match. Okay, start match up. One randomly booked Iron Man match on your show. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, I don't know if I want those, um, but I am going to play this. Six random superstars will have the popularity increase by six. Why not? Confirm. Let's go. So Carmella, Aaliyah, Shayna Baszler, Commander Aziz, Natalia, and Mace. Oh no, is Aaliyah not my least popular anymore? Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Let me, let me double check. It is fulfilled. Okay. So Aaliyah still is my least popular. No, it's LA Knight, but he is booked, right? He's booked? Question mark? Yes, he's booked. Fine. Great. Uh, and he's in the tag title feud. Can't do any logistics. What free agents we got here? Drew McIntyre. Can't afford any of these guys. Kyle Slickman. Lula Tandy. Argus the Great. Oh my God, I love these. Captain Grog. I love these guys. Flint McStones. Oh my God, these are wonderful. These medical bill. <gasps> I love him. I love him so much. Don't even care. I mean, his name is Medical Bill. How can I not assign him? It's Medical Bill. His name's Medical Bill. How can I not sign him? <laughs> Medical Bill! I'm gonna save my legend one. Uh, unless there's a legend I particularly want to get in the next 30 seconds, which I don't think there is! Um, yeah, I'll save that for when I'm, I feel like I need to spruce up my, my rivalries or whatever. Um, I bet. Uh, eight, uh, three power cards. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. Yeah, uh, yeah sure. I can't do any of that. Uh, but I believe that is my show. I think that's everything done there. Just normal matches, nothing crazy to start with. Let's confirm that booking. How was that, Pete? Uh, that was okay, you know? Yeah. That was okay. okay um, cool. I, I, I had to figure some feuds out on the fly because <laughs> I hadn't planned it. I spent that time jamming out to willpower instead. Uh, but I think I came up with some good some good options. Good. I think it's, I, a, it's, it's a solid it's first this week. This is very warm, Pete. It's, I get sweaty hands. Yeah, this is warm, dude. <laughs> yeah, it's warm in here. Well, and I'm nervous. I was uh, getting pussy like Pink Panther. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone go check out Scene Queen. She rules. I hate it so much. <laughs> okay, right. Okay. Here we go. So, Ooh. opener. Steel cage title match. Oh, my God. <laughs> Rhea Ripley, the champ. Defending Rhea Ripley against, against uh, Asuka. Against Asuka here. So what a let's match. Stimulate this one. All Two, right. three. <gasps> Asuka, Brand new, new champ. champ in Asuka with a four, four star. star. And new rivalry as new well. Rivalry as well. So that Amazing. Didn't, I, that was a steel cage because steel cage adds 50% chance of going into a level two right off the oh, bat. Or if you're level two, going up to level three. Wow, great. Obviously, if you level up in that one as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Amazing. Anyway, that's fine. Oh, level one. Should write that I down. I should write that down, Pete. Make a note of that. Yep, it's important. important Asuka, stuff. Rhea, one. Great. Beautiful. Little charity promo here. Charity promo from Doudrop. Yep. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Good stuff. Yeah. Yeah.
Tag Tyler team Bate title and match. Cody Rhodes. Tyler Bate and Cody Rhodes versus Cedric and Sami Zayn. Let's stimulate this one. Who are our inaugural <gasps> tag team champs? It's Cedric and Sammy. Cedric and Sammy. Three and half stars as well. New, New rivalry as well. Rivalry. What's the uh, what's the tag team name of both your current tag team champions and Cody Rhodes and Tyler Bate? Um, the it's uh, um, uh, Sam Zander. Sam Zander uh, versus Tyler Bate is the best. That's what their tag team name is. See what I would have said. It's because obviously Cody has the Cody Vader. Cody Vader. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's the that's the team name, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Brackets, Tyler Bate is the best. Sure. Uh, Tyler Bate. Little self promo there. That's all right. I was just trying to up, up her popularity a little bit, but just by one, just by one. That'll solid. do us. Solid, solid, solid. Here we go. Last man standing match for oh the mid card title. For the one, US title. Two, three. Good. Good star. Three star. No rivalry. No rivalry. Well, that's a shame. <laughs> Nice little cherry promo. Cherry promo, Mindy Hartwell. Thank Excellent. you very much, Indy. And your WWE no! champion, oh, Logan. Off as Logan Paul, the WWE champion. Well, WWE champion defends a backstage a brawl. Yeah, we, absolutely, yeah. Doesn't that cost 90 grand? Oh, it sure does, Pete. Pete, I had a lot of money spare. Oh, my God. Okay. Yeah. So, WWE champion Logan Paul. Unbelievable. Defending the belt against Kevin Owens. Unbelievable. Let's stimulate this one. Two, three. Logan, Logan Paul is still the Retains. WWE champion. Three and a half star main. And that is a rivalry. That is a rivalry. That rivalry road. God. What a big show that was, Pete. Well, it's the big show. <laughs> What have you got on SmackDown? On the contrary, we've got all normal matches this week. <laughs> <laughs> but we have W, or yeah, W Universal Champion Universal Shinsuke Champion. Nakamura. Hopefully, starting a gravel here with <laughs> Solo Sokoa. I mean, Pete, yeah. we're on the precipice of something huge. Here. <gasps> Nakamura starts a feud. I mean, I, I did end last season with Nakamura rompleting a rivalry. You did. So it just took a while to get there. It took me so long. Yeah. This is historic mm -hmm. if he can do this on week one. On week one. Here we go. Come it's on. All, it's all on you, Nax. Let's go. Versus Solo Sokoa. <gasps> Solo Sokoa, new champ. New Blue Universal champion. And a rivalry. Why is that only two and a half stars? <laughs> but that's okay, I guess. That's okay, Pete. Yeah, that's, that's fine. It's fine. Two and a half star opener. Not bad. Max. Sokoa. One. <laughs> Two and a half. F***ing hell, gang. <laughs> All right. Call out promo with Shayna Baszler, Nikki A.S.H. It was okay, and it did not start a rivalry. Oh, maybe, maybe did it. Maybe you press continue, we'll do. Nope. Nope, sure didn't, Pete. It's fine. Aaliyah and Dana Brooke. So this... So. This could have been a different match mm. but i did kind of run out of time to change it okay so originally well still is my commissioner goal for this week was to book my lowest popularity superstar which is Aaliyah. Mm -hmm. so i was like great i can do that booked Aaliyah in this match hopefully start a few with dana brooke i then played my smackdown exclusive power card which boosts six random people's popularity by six oh. which then meant that Aaliyah was not <laughs> my lowest <laughs> ranked superstar <laughs> but but i had already booked my new lowest superstar in a match so i'd already still fulfilled it but i didn't really think about changing this match until the last minute i was like ah it's already there it's already there so it's a leer and dana brooke cool good mid card match mate cool little one and a half star match this will be or maybe two leah well done Aaliyah. that one and a half star as i as i suspected Aaliyah. <laughs> Dana? The good news is it did not outperform your opener. <laughs> As expected. <laughs> Could have done. Shelly B. <laughs> <laughs> Call out. It's a weak promo, but it works. But it worked. You got yourself a rivalry there with Marseille. But all together, Pete. <laughs> all of you do it at home. <laughs> <laughs> okay, great. We've got our mid card. We've got our men's tag team title match. Big Dick Balor and Angel versus Commander Aziz and LA Knight. So you're saying that their tag team is the Big Dick Angels? Big Dick Angels. <laughs> or I the other it. ones? LA Aziz. Hmm. Could have gone with the Knight Commanders. That's silly. 
<laughs> you're right, Pete. No, you're right, Pete. That is silly. <laughs> Let's see you later. Who's Who? the inaugural attack champs? Because the champs. It's the Knight Commanders. <laughs> that great name that I came up with. No f rivalry though. Yeah, it's hard for the tag. Oh no, I got a f***ing one. Take. It's all right, Pete. Okay. Ilya Dragunov for the charity promo. Thank you, mate. <clears throat> Cheers, mate. Five five thousand fans there. I feel like that's the best use of Ilya Dragunov. <laughs> hey, let's on. It's not like WWE are doing more than him <laughs> like, currently, right? At the main event, we've got our women's champ Bianca Belair in a tables match. Hopefully. Starting a feud with Carmella. I mean, it says rivalry on screen. That would make me think that it, it does is. say that. Yeah. Simulate. Two, Two three. three. Bianca Belair retains. retains. And a rivalry. Four star Four with star. a rivalry. Very, Very good. good. Good main event there, mate. Just the main event. <clears throat> Carmella. One. Okay, I got I got four rivalries out of that show. That's better than I don't. Only got three. Bad. Ain't bad at all. That's pretty good, Pete. Considering I had six segments that could have. Four worked. More than half. That's more than, uh, Pete, that is better than I did, so yep. well done, bud. Well, let's head over and see the results. Christ, Ooh. you did a better show than I did. Good booking all round. No right. injuries. Ask a new champ. Yeah. Got your inaugural men's tag champs as well, the That's Raw Tag it. Team Champions. Yeah, yeah. And look at that. Logan Paul, still your WWE champion. Gunter. Unbelievable. Your new United States champion. Mm -hmm, did mm -hmm, not mm -hmm. start a grind for Nope. But Solo Sokoa, new Universal new Champ. New Universal Champion in yeah. Solo Sokoa. Yeah. Your new Tag Team Champions. The, the Knight Commanders. That's yeah. right. Aaliyah was also there. Yep. And, and Bianca, Bianca Belair. Belair. Well done, mate. Very nice. Considering, like, look how like I spent way more on my show. Significantly more, yes. And really, like, you know, I got well, four 3.53 and a 3.5. We will see how that uh, converts into fans, though. Yeah. Because I think you're, you're probably going to be ahead of me this week. <laughs> I reckon. Let's have a look. Let's find out. Show quality D. 57,000 fans there. So that's 1. Point, that's 1.06. <laughs> you lost 122 grand on that show, I mate. Sure did, because I booked a lot of big matches. Hot dog. But that was that was I knew that was gonna happen mm. because I wanted to just go out the gates hot. Mm -hmm. Um, it's done so well for you in previous seasons. Well, that's it, yeah. And also I wanted I was curious to see how much. Mm -hmm. Like doing madder matches yep. would like increase this. Not ladder matches. Madder matches. <laughs> <laughs> That's good, Pete. Yep. Tyler Bates got a real good feel for tables matches. Good to know that. Yeah. Tyler Bates and Cody Rhodes were well together as a tag team. That's good. Oh, uh, yeah. The Cody Rhodes was robbed. Yeah. Not the way that Cedric should have won. Indy Harwell killed it with that charity promo. Started strong, ended strong. Zayn and Alexander, the new champs. Bates and Rose just didn't have the answers. Really varied show. Added to the quality, keep it up. Ah, oh, Cedric. So, Cedric and Sammy worked okay as a tag team. That's because they're both cruisers. Mm. So that should answer your question. Or it could just be that it's random. Oh, it could also be could that. Could be that too. Yeah. Uh, cool. So that is me. So that is... That's the new thing on this, folks. It does not tell you off the bat who is number one or number two for the we'll week we'll have to figure it out later though but it does, seen it will, your number it will tell you afterwards yeah yeah, yeah. yeah we'll have to figure it out later but so we can see the number 1 million so. Uh, 67 so great let's see how we get on Pete oh oh dear hey that's not that Pete that's only 10,000 10,000 less, less and that's because I had the yeah, ball, backstage, backstage brawl right? which adds 10,000 mm, fans so true. despite the fact I booked wild matches mm. I only brought in 10,000 fans from that one match step. Yeah. Feels like that should have been bigger. <laughs> you know what I mean? We're here again. <laughs> we are here again, Pete. Where I'm starting looking at this being like, but what are the rules? <laughs> Garza Rabala worked really well. Big Dick Angel <laughs> coming in strong. What are they, just out of curiosity? A uh, cruiser and a fighter. Hmm. So that's interesting. Shelton trying to lay down the law to Marseille in a promo, but it kind of sucked. But did it start a rivalry? Yes. And then Nine Commander sees won the vacated tag titles against the Big Dick Angels. Mm. Shame the title isn't awarded on a DQ. Wait, what? Huh? Huh? What? Do they not? Are they not the champs? No, because not sure if I could take from him about a, after a DQ. Who are the champions? <laughs> Who are Pete's champs? 
Is it, Do is I it... have champions? Wait, so you're telling me that the winners of the tag match doesn't matter because the titles don't change hands on a DQ? Why was it a DQ? Have the titles changed hands or not? Because this is fighting for the vacant titles. Are they still vacant? I don't know what's happening. Do I have tag champions or not? This, it's in! Phenomenal takeover 98! No, LA Knight and Commander Seas won the yeah. vacated tag titles. Shame the title isn't awarded on a DQ. But it says they won the titles. They won the tag title fight. Oh. But the title isn't... Do I have tag champions or not? This is how you want to start a new season. <laughs> <laughs> Figure it out next week, I guess. Yeah, still good profit, mate. Well done. Yeah, thanks. Money. So there you go. One, One million, million forty-seven. 47. So right. here we're going to find out. One, it is more. You, God's next week. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one. Oh, I got free crew, free crew booking for your commissioner goal. What was your commissioner goal? I uh, was book your least popular bruiser, who was either um, KO or Rhea or Logan Paul. No, just KO or Rhea. <laughs> least popular. Logan Paul, WWE champion. Uh, there's either KO or Rhea. Okay. So either one of those is my lowest. That makes sense, yeah. It's probably KO, really, because yep. of Rhea's champ. Mm -hmm. uh, so yeah, free, free crew booking, lovely for me. Number one! You're 20,000 in front. Not, not 10, it's 20. Look at that! Good news, Luke! Ha-ha! So the, the fan change didn't take into account the 10,000 that you got in from the brawl, because the fan change was 57,000, but you ended up with 67,000 more. So that fan change number was actually different. No, no, it was what you ended up. It was 10,000 for the backstage brawl mm -hmm. and 10,000 for the charity promo. Exactly, That's yes. 20,000. Yes. Oh, but where would you lose 10? I didn't lose 10. No, I know, I know. But as in, like, how did I get 10 more? Maybe it's through the Mad Match. Well, I needed one charity promo. Yeah. So and, did I. Yeah. No, you did two. No, I did one. How'd you get 10,000 from a charity promo, then? You did two. Oh, I did two. Yeah, you did I two. I did do two. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, you're right. I did so do two. You got 10,000 from charity. Yeah. 10,000 from the backstage brawl. Yeah. 20,000 difference. Ba -ba 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 so you got an extra 5,000 pounds because I did one cherry point. Well, yeah, whatever, it doesn't matter. But that's, it doesn't point matter. Is, point is, is. he's number one right now. Number one. <laughs> Definitely not the same guy with a different <laughs> <laughs> Looks so silly. <laughs> Look, Pete, we're just lucky it isn't like top, it's only top half because none of us yep. are wearing trousers. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just like on this show. Just like on this show. We bottomless no round here. Yeah. I'm bottomless, Pete, but I'm also... So here's a question, because I did my commissioner goal. Mm -hmm. It has not popped up to tell me I have done my commissioner goal. Oh yeah, well did you do it? I definitely did, because I checked it, because it was LA Knight was now my least popular guy after I did the power card. Mm. And he was on the show, because he technically won the tag titles. <laughs> I'm, I'm just curious if I pre- No, that's nope. just, no, that's, no, that's, no, that's, that's just no, next no. week. <laughs> I. I might have got a power card, I might not. So I I completed my commissioner goal, right? Like you, you, you guys saw that, you guys saw that, you saw that, I completed my commissioner goal. I didn't get anything that said I completed my commissioner goal, so do I have the power card or not? It's a really good power card as well. Yeah. Like, re like really good. Well, it is, but we're not gonna see a lot of the crew things. Oh, mine's not a free crew booking. No, mine's something different. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's a really good power card. Did you have to book them in a singles match? No, I just said book them. Okay, interesting. And it said fulfilled after I played my power card. It mm. said, yeah, you've done that. So we'll see if I've got it next week. Because I might not have somehow. Pete, are you ready? Okay. For the <laughs> return of Mr. Higglesby! <laughs> what? What's happened to him? And you can go and watch that episode right now over at patreon.com forward slash WrestleTalk. And also over on our Patreon page, you can get access to our behind the scenes podcast with myself and Luke, where we sit down and chat about the episode that's transpired, our behind the scenes thoughts and feelings, and any other behind the scenes stories we have surrounding the episode too. And kind of talking about our booking in general, maybe thoughts we have, any future mm -hmm. plans that we might have exactly. as well. Get into all the minutia of things. Mm -hmm. It's a very, very fun time. So head on over to patreon.com forward slash WrestleTalk to find out more. And if you're in the mood for 
clicking links. Click the link in the video description down below because this episode is sponsored by WWE 2K23. You can get your copy from the game using our link in the video description down below. Play through the showcase mode with John Cena and the new War Games match type as well. But really, you should all be playing the MyGM mode. It's so fun. It's so good. I'm having a great time back again. And hopefully, if you play, you'll get your power cut <laughs> after your first week. <laughs> Go row some rivalries on your own time. But until then, I've been Luco in DAD representing Monday Night Raw. I've been Chopper Pequenel representing Monday Night SmackDown. Jam that jam. Chopper.